AI can help deal with some very difficult challenges like disease and climate change, but we also have to address the potential risk to our society, to our economy, to our national security. AI has the potential to transform you know, every aspect of our lives. We all know that. We talk to not just business, but the defense community as well to make sure the UK is well positioned, not just to capitalize on the opportunities that we all are aware of, but also to protect ourselves against the risks that the technology might pose. AI is, um perhaps uh, more dangerous than, say, mismanaged uh, aircraft design or production maintenance or, or, or bad car production uh, in the sense that it is, it has the potential, uh, how small one may regard that probability, but it is non-trivial. It has the potential of civilizational destruction. Governments and tech experts have been sounding alarm regarding the dangers artificial intelligence could have on society. President Joe Biden met with CEOs of top artificial intelligence companies including Microsoft and Alphabet's Google and made it clear that they must ensure their products are safe before they are deployed. This comes days after a pioneer of artificial intelligence, Geoffrey Hinton, quit Google to speak freely about the technology's dangers. He says that computers could become smarter than people far sooner than he and other experts had expected. He tweeted that he left Google so that he could talk about the dangers of AI without considering how this impacts Google. You can imagine a teenager who just for a bit of fun gets it to write a program to attack some critical government service, a cyber attack on some critical government service. Now, that's probably not going to mean the end of the world, but it's, uh, it can potentially be extremely damaging. In an interview with the New York Times, Hinton said that he was worried about AI's capacity to create convincing false images and texts, creating a world where people will not be able to know what is true anymore. It's hard to see how you can prevent the bad actors from using it for bad things, he says. They're more worried about the ways in which AI is going to be used by people. So it's a tool that could be used in the wrong ways, in damaging ways. And I think that's a real concern. Samsung Electronics has banned the use of ChatGPT and other AI-powered chatbots by its employees. The crackdown was prompted by the discovery of an accidental leak of sensitive internal source code by an engineer who uploaded it to ChatGPT last month. Since Microsoft-backed startup OpenAI released ChatGPT in November, the growing number of generative AI applications that can create text or images have provoked concerns of the future regulation of the technology. Here are 10 major dangers that AI can cause. Accidents caused by autonomous machines or robots. Bias and discrimination perpetuated by AI algorithms. Job displacement due to automation. Cybersecurity threats including more sophisticated phishing attacks. Malicious use such as developing autonomous weapons or deep fakes. Lack of transparency and accountability in AI decision making. Dependence on AI leading to loss of critical skills and decision making abilities. Ethical concerns such as privacy violations and infringement on human rights. Unintended consequences of AI such as unintended bias or unintended outcomes. And risks associated with AI governance and regulation including lack of international consensus and potential for misuse. These dangers can have significant impacts on society ranging from economic disruption to loss of life. It's important to address these concerns and develop AI that's safe, transparent and beneficial for humans.